Hello Cadre, good afternoon. A uh, different video today. Got a couple of boxes to open and I've enjoyed watching you guys do your unboxing so I thought I'd join you. Um, I know what's in both of them but uh, I'll let you all find out as we go. So starting with the bigger one here. And, uh, Oh, so this is a uh, BST that I bought. Well, I, uh, yeah, it was posted on um, Facebook on one of the forums there. Um, so I bought a few things, and he had two prices, one for the smaller box, one if it had to fit in a larger box. And uh, we were kind of negotiating. I said, hey, if you just do the bigger box so I don't have to try to squish it in there, I'll throw in some extras. So it looks like you threw in quite a few extras but this one is from the shaving shop the club the closer um, haven't smelled this one before but um, just try to do some quick research hmm actually smells pretty good and it looks like a brand new tub so that's pretty cool got my my wife's over there laughing at me currently might have to turn turn the uh, camera that way. Some uh, SV Cosmo aftershave. I've been wanting this for a while. I've got the soap. But I thought that I had the aftershave, but I guess I didn't. So I need the match for that. And also the Stella Alpina. So these are both just to uh, finish up sets that I've got. And then the last thing that I bought is right here. And I'm going to leave that for the last thing in here so it's a little little special and all of this other stuff is extra things he included so this is a stingray sample from and my eyes aren't good enough something through the fire and i know that i've looked at this company before i just don't recall what it is um, but a sample from them and it's interesting sting I don't know what Stingray is supposed to smell like, but that's more of a very clean, soapy barbershop kind of thing. Tobbs Lavender. Ah, chisel Face Sherlock, which uh, I just finished up my sample of this when we were on vacation, so this will replace that one. Sterling unscented mentholated balm. Well, I can't use menthol, so this will end up getting passed on sooner or later. Tobbs peppermint. Never used that one. Oh man. Wonder if they. I don't think they put menthol in their soaps, but that's that uh, smells pretty strong. Formula tea garlic tweed. I think I've used this one. I like that one. A lot of stuff in here. Soap Commander Endurance Sample. Don't know anything about that one. Barrister and Man Aftershave Splashes. Um, this will be a good filler uh, for me when I send something off. Um, don't care for that. Their smell so much. Shave Revolution. Now the only way I know about these guys is I have... Um, you might see in my posts all the time that I use a synthetic knot that I glued into a Shave Revolution handle. That I really don't have any idea how I got that. But I know nothing about their soaps. And again, the, this one's supposed to be Oud Wood. The Gentleman. But I don't know. It smells almost like nothing. Maybe a little bit of wood, not much. And some more... What is this? Gentle Savage. I don't know. And this is in a... Unfortunately, it's like in a little to-go food container they put them in. So it's already broken up and stuff. Doesn't smell bad. Very cologne-y. I'll have to try that one this week. Um, this is from the Soap of the Gods Company, which is cool because I've been to their site many times. They've got, I don't know, 50 different scents. So I thought about getting some samples of them. Um, never pulled the trigger because I'm a little bit worried about performance. So actually, uh, that'll be neat trying them. <laughs> it 
So for the god, was up. Looks like a water scent. Hmm. But no, uh, subtle, but almost like if you, I don't, I don't know, like Axe body spray or something like that. A subtle version of that. Um, and then this one, I can't even, Jared, it looks like. I don't know. Again, but unfortunately, all three of these are broken. So you can see this one's actually dried out a little bit. So we'll have to try those out this week. Oh, here's a fourth one. Love. Love shaving soap. Soap of the gods. I'm betting that's a, that's a rose, which I'll normally take a pass on. No, it's not a rose, but it is very floral. Uh, more samples in here. Chiseled face. Cedar and spice. Getting near the end here. London Barber Shop by Maggards. It's a nice, clean, soapy scent. Bulldog Skin Care for Men Sensitive Shaving Cream. Now, I've never used a cream. I don't know if I'm going to start. So, I'm afraid. This one is... That's pretty, uh... That's pretty, uh... Sealed up, so I wanted to... Untwist it to get a better smell. I don't know. I can't smell enough much so I don't know if I'll try that one or not. Lavanel and this doesn't even have a company on it so if you know who does that type of a scent let me know. Uh, never mind we'll be tossing this one that doesn't look so great and I don't like lavender scents all that much either so that's a goner. And then a few other Point Reef Fougere I'll try that one and Point Reef Tranquility. So this is cool. All these extras, most of them are, are things I've never tried before. So the last thing I bought that I'm pretty excited about, um, Russian tea. As you guys know, I was a very generously piffed a tub of this on our own shaving cadre. Um, so very happy with that. Full tub and I'll tell you I got this because little teaser I hope Chad's okay with that um, there's something new that will be coming out on the cadre very shortly um, we're almost ready to go so I don't know if it'll be tomorrow or they'll need a few more days but um, because of what is coming out some of you will be able to try this soap um, so I'll be getting that ready um, and more to come on all that so that's box one. Box two, you can see who this is from. Been waiting for these suckers. Um, and I don't know, I, I think uh, Eric gets a ton of praise and it's all deserved. And um, I don't think those of us that talk about when he goes professional or quits his job or starts doing this full time, None of us are joking about that. I don't think uh, this craftsmanship is top notch. Um, and I can pretty much guarantee you that these will not be uh, the last two brushes that I ordered from Eric. Um, I, could, I could see having a, a den just full of his stuff. So, packaged very well. Thank you, Eric. Gently cut this off. So, this is. Uh, my alma mater is Oregon State. Our colors are orange and black. So we've got the black synthetic knot and an orange handle. Oh. And that looks just awesome. I'll see if I can get some pictures later. I don't know if I can do as good with the pictures as Eric has. But just that where the, the wood and the, the plastic merge there. Man. Love it. And one more. Oh, even through the plastic, this color is awesome. Looking forward to tomorrow's shades for sure. Oh, look at that. That is gorgeous. I don't know if how well you can see inside there. Oh, look at that. So cool. 
All right. Well, got a lot of soaps, got some aftershaves, got some new brushes to use, got a borrowed razor that I'm working on. So this is going to be a fun weekend, guys. Um, probably post a video shave uh, one of the two days with some of this stuff. And I'll see you on the forums. Thank you.